Hello and welcome back to The Legend of Kyrandia, book three, Malcolm's Revenge. Um, when we last left off, I was gathering up all the ingredients that I needed to make the cream sandwich. Uh, so let's go ahead and continue on doing this. That's not the direction I need to go. Um... I'm gonna speed up all these animations to help make this go faster. Um, the the more that I'm doing this, the more I'm realizing this is probably one of the more frustrating parts of the game. Um, solely for the fact that there's so many minor details you have to do. I'm gonna go ahead and. Well, actually, no, I need that later. Um, I, this might come in handy. It might. I need to go and do that though. All right, so let's go in here. And. Uh. Sm smell that dairy air. Alright, so we need to fertilize the seeds and then we need to make them grow. And then we need another set of seeds. We need to fertilize them and I need a third one. Alright, but I don't have any water yet so let's go ahead and go ahead and grab some water again real quick. This might come in handy. It's a long process to do all of this, but I'm I'm doing it for the sake of later in the game when I'm doing all the alternate ways to leave the island, because otherwise I'd have to do a lot more backtracking, and it, I'm trying to make it easier for me in the long run. So bear with me if you're unentertained. Unentertained. All right, just put one in there. Put the other one in there. And in come a herd of cows. They start filling up the whole thing of cream. We poke it. I said we poke it. All right. And we fill this up with cream. It's leaking cream. Yes, so fill it up. Thank you. Okay. I think, yeah, that's all we need. Okay, yeah. Just the three ingredients for the sandwich are the cream, the eel, and the seeds. Okay. So the next thing we need to do is we need to be able to... Um, actually make the sandwich and there is a um, a place inside downtown Kyrania where you can do such that but pretty much almost everyone who sees us is gonna be like Malcolm you're not supposed to be here and they will kick us out of the establishment so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna save because I gotta make sure I do this right um, uh, I need to type okay um, because I've honestly I've been having difficulties with these and it's it's starting to get a little more more frustrating. So I'm just trying to make sure I do this right. So we need to go ahead and head into here, I believe. That always works. Okay. Hey, you're Malcolm. Who? You're Malcolm, the court jester who killed the king. Not me. I don't know any Malcolm. You really look like him. I'm sorry. I've never even heard of the guy. Oh, okay. No, I don't know any Malcolm. Handled like a pro. Never underestimate the power of the lie. That did go better than expected. Alright, so we're going to put this back. <laughs> You're not messing with those controls, are you? No, sir. <laughs> I would never touch such delicate equipment. What we need to Good. do is we need to make the bath water very hot. <laughs> oh, is this... Oh, I think I see how it works. Okay. Alright. Hey, what's the ruckus? And now I believe we need to... Now that was fun! From the confusion, I need to grab this, okay. And I should be able to go ahead and leave now. Okay. 
believe I can put it on now too. This jerkin might do the trick. I don't know if I need the hanger for anything. I don't know if this is a full disguise now or not. I don't think it is. Um, I don't know if my inventory is big enough for all of this. Let me see if I can go ahead and at least make the sandwich, because if I can make the sandwich that'll free up my inventory for everything else. Alright, um, oh that's right, I need to use the seeds to lure him over. I know this seems weird, but I I'll explain in a minute why I need this squirrel. Mr. Squirrel, you're getting sleepy. Very sleepy. God, that's such a weird looking squirrel. I can't believe that old trick still works. I love this guy. Oh, Gunther. You just go away. Nobody likes you, Gunther. Um, I'm gonna set the hanger down here. I don't think I need it. But I could be wrong, but it'll stay there, so. Okay. And I'm gonna save before I do this. Oops. I need to go in here. Quickly. Okay. So let me save real quick and make sure that I do this right. I can't believe I have to wear it. Alright, so, there's a lot of people here and we need this machine, but there's so many people that we can't do anything. Hmm, maybe this squirrel will get the attention of these weird. But if you remember correctly, the Kyrandium squirrels are very vicious. Hmm, maybe this squirrel will get the attention of these weirdos. The place is packed with these idiots. This works last time. There's got to be some kind of distraction I could cause. Oh, that's right. That would get rid of these jerks. I remember now. Go away. Okay, little buddy. Do your thing. The squirrel just goes like, flying around. I don't know what it's doing. But everyone runs out of the building. All right. Hey. What was all that ruckus? And where'd everybody go? What? I didn't see anything. Oh, that's just terrific. Okay. So I believe now... I'm here on behalf of King Brandon. He wants a sandwich. We sent four dozen to the castle already. Well, he wants one more. I think we can go ahead and start adding the ingredients. Yeah, that's all right, so we need an eel. It goes eel, cream, oh, and then the seeds, I forgot the seeds, or is the cream last? Thanks. Oh, I guess that doesn't matter, okay. Um, let me go back and grab the seeds real quick. I completely forgot that I used them on the, uh, on the squirrel. So, but that's why it's not very far away, which is good. And all the cows are gone. Sesame. Can I pick it up? Okay. Alrighty. So this is good, this is great, we're, I'm doing much better than I was this the more I think about it, the more... Uh, this game is good, it's just... It's, there's so many minor, tiny little details that you have to do, or you kind of screw it up, so... Thanks. I mean... Great. Now we're back in business. Turn it. And you got a sandwich. Alright, so now we have two sandwiches. We're gonna go ahead and we're gonna use one of them. If we head back into here, and drop down this hole here, we will find ourselves in a magical place. Hello. Down there. That sewer looks deep. It's not that bad. Any... Oh, sorry. I, uh, I didn't think he was still talking. Ow. Alright, and now they give us another flask if we need it. I don't believe that we do, though. But what we do need is. Uh, what we do need. There we go. 
<laughs> we need another eel. Okay, I don't think we need that flask. Not unless that one's full of something, but we'll leave that there just in case. Alright, this wonderful place is the Hunton Hall, and this is the Voice of Reason. What the heck is I this? I just said. I think I remember. Isn't that the Voice of Reason? Very good. This is where it lives. Now, you'll notice that it's not... What the heck is this? I think I... What? It's not moving, it's not doing anything, but you'll notice it has a sandwich in its hand. So let's give it a sandwich. Thanks. I just love fish cream sandwiches. And now he's awake. Can you speak? I am the voice of reason. Can you reason with that pig-headed cat? <laughs> I can only judge. I cannot preach. Can you help me get out of Carandia? That, I'm afraid, is your problem. But should you ever have the means to summon King William's ghost, I'll be pleased to act as judge and hear the evidence against you. Yeah, he doesn't... The Voice of Reason doesn't have much of a role now. And frankly, I'm not even sure if you need to give him the sandwich. Um, but I always find it a good idea to go and give him the sandwich. And it kind of gives you another hint. Like, if you ever, you know, get what you need to summon King William, you know, I'll help you out. And, you know, even Catherine says to summon William. It, it It's kind of subtly hinted at that that's what you're trying to do. But it's... It's not the main focus of the game, it feels like. It's, I don't know, they did the plot really weird in this. But alright, now that he's awake, we can go ahead and head out the front door now. Okay. I think... I don't think I have all the items ready for each of the different endings. But I definitely think that I have... Um... I've I've done all the the other stuff. Um, I believe. Well, actually, I need a log real quick. That's right. I mean, there's there's six different ways to leave this island, so it's it, it's really there's a lot of work involved with it. So what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go and I'm gonna save here, and I'm gonna do the easiest way to exit this game. So. Um, um, or I'm gonna call it exit one. So that's my that's how my saves are gonna be called for this particular exit. All right. So what we actually need for this exit, um, if you remember correctly, when we fertilize those seeds, they grow pretty instant as soon as we've got water with them. So let's go Sesame ahead, seed. pick up a seed, and fertilize it with this eel. And go ahead and get ourselves some water because if you noticed when we were back down in the sewers there was um, a part of the brick wall that looked really, really weak, like it could break really easily. Let's go ahead and jump back down. And he'll say, ow. ow. Yeah, I know. All right, let's go ahead and fill this up with water. Loaded with water. And what we actually need to do is put the seeds on the wall. My little toys are ready to play. And then we can fertilize it and it'll grow and bust open the wall for us. I don't know why it makes an exploding noise. <laughs> And I'm gonna go ahead and pick up this flask just in case I need it for something else. Which I guess it doesn't really matter at this point. All right, pretty empty room. The only obvious thing here is to click on this. And open it up. Voila, I did it. I wonder what I did. <laughs> so then you put your flask over here and now you have a portal potion. Now, it's obvious to me because I've done it so much where I'm supposed to go, but there's actually very specific ways you need to use this potion, just the same way that you would need to use the unicorn potion in the old games. And it's actually right over here, where this giant frog is. Um, uh, yes. This is the launching spot for portal potions. Yep. Uh, okay, so I can't get him to walk on it prematurely, but if you go ahead and click the potion on him... I think it's time to get off this stinky guy. I agree. We get some pretty effects going on here. And voila! 
We are now in the ancient ruins, and we cannot see ah, anything. I'm still alive. Yep. And I've lost my disguise. Oh, he rhymed. Now, to plot my revenge on those fools. Ha ha. Alrighty. Huh? What? Mildred, is that you? I kind of wish I could disable Gunther, but um, I don't know if this is a required step, but it's good to kind of observe how dark it is. It doesn't look very safe here. That's actually not that bad. All right, but what we need to do is we need to exit, and there's dogs and a cat. Let's... Howdy, I'm Malcolm. Pleased to meet you, Malcolm. I'm Duke. I think I need to be. Where's all the cats? Where have you been? We took over the oh, island normal, years okay. ago. I was gonna say, I think I need to be nice when talking to these guys, but all right, most important thing before you do anything else, pick up this machete. And oh yeah, by the way, our inventory is empty now. So, which is, you know, it's it's pretty good. We're gonna need all the space we can get, but put it in there and save the game because you need that machete for the rest of your life. So this is exit one or exit, I guess exit two. No, exit one. I guess save too. That's probably a better way to word it. Okay. So we don't need to talk to him. Um. Psst, mister. Hello there. What can I do for you? Go find Fluffy. He's in the jungle. So now we have to go find Fluffy. And this is where the game gets tedious. I will try to do this as best as possible. Um. And I'm going to be completely honest. I'm going to make sure that I... Yeah, here we go. What a lot of trees. All right, I'm going to make sure that I do this right. All right, now this... There is one very important detail that you need to remember. Um, some of these leaves that you cut down will have, uh, like, blue kissy snakes behind them. If you don't hit them immediately, they will kill you. They will kiss Malcolm to death and he will die and you'll have to start over. So, like those. It should be very quick. Um, These are too thick. But this is what's really weird about this. I used to think I went the right way. These are too thick to cut. Okay. Um, I actually think I, I went the right way for Fluffy, but not for something else I need to do. But that's okay. Um, because I can do them both pretty much simultaneously. Right. But basically, you have to clear these out. There's also another aspect to this. Um, I can't go up from here, so I guess it's one more over. Oh crap, I needed that bone. Shoot. There'll be plenty of others for me to grab. These are too thick. Just 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 chop them away. Alright, I think that's a bone I can pick up. Oh, oh yeah, well here, I might as well go ahead and do this. Um this is the other aspect. Um Malcolm will start itching himself the longer you are in the dungeon. Um, if you don't click on him until he feels better, you will eventually die. I don't know how long it takes for the fleas to kill you, but they will eventually kill you. And this is Fluffy. Psst. Hey, man. Hello. Who are you? I am Fluffy. Are you with the revolution? I am now. Maybe. What's the trouble? The capitalist dogs have taken over our island. Okay, so they have taken over our island. Apparently, okay. We need to actually be lying to talk to him. Here we go. So, are you with us? You can count on me. Good. Take the mouse and raise the colossus. All right. The order of massification must be repaired. So now... Oh, excuse me. Ter terribly sorry. Now we have a leather mouse, which its use will become apparent much more later. But there's another detail that we have to take care of, and I want to go ahead and take care of it now so that I don't have to worry about it later. Um, but I'm going to go and I'm going to end the video here, and we will get to that tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching. Um, the next video that I have uploaded will probably be the other options to get off the island. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to compile it into just one big video. So anyone who wants to watch it can. If they don't, they can just skip on to the next episode. And I'll have them labeled accordingly so that you'll 
you'll see in the playlist that, you know, it's just the different ways to leave the island. So if you don't want to watch it, you can be like, oh, this is, this is that one and skip it. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. Um, but thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a wonderful day.